And now we're going to turn to that real life Breaking Bad. Two Arkansas chemistry professors arrested, accused of making meth in their classroom. Will Reed is here now with the story and how they get, how they were caught. Good morning, Will. Yeah, good morning, Michael. These men were under investigation after reports of a strange odor coming from a lab revealed a high level of a chemical found in meth. Remarkably, one of the professors already had a nickname inspired by Breaking Bad and said the show would entice students to study chemistry. Now the two professors are under arrest. It's real life imitating art. Two Breaking Bad wannabe professors busted for allegedly creating a meth lab in a university classroom in Arkansas. This, this is art, Mr. White. Actually, it's just basic chemistry, but thank you, Jesse. I'm glad it's acceptable. Police say they arrested doctors Terry David Bateman and Bradley Rowland from Arkansas's Henderson State University Friday following an investigation done in conjunction with school police. HSU telling ABC News that someone reported an undetermined chemical odor, which it says after testing, quote, indicated an elevated presence of benzyl chloride in a laboratory, a molecular compound that scientists say could be used in creating the drug. I saw your setup. Ridiculous. You and I will not make garbage. This is where we give our undergraduate students the opportunity uh, to get in the lab and, and do some real hands-on work. Bateman, seen here in this promotional video on the university's YouTube page, has been teaching at the school for over a decade. According to his school bio, he's always been interested in pharmaceuticals. Roland, who's been on staff for five years, was nicknamed Henderson Heisenberg by the school paper in 2014 after admitting he was a fan of the AMC hit show and crediting Breaking Bad's success with students becoming more interested in chemistry, saying, I feel like it was a wonderful recruiting tool. Both professors reportedly placed on administrative leave and under investigation. The university says it is cooperating with authorities. Police say the criminal investigation is ongoing. The men will face a judge pending formal charging decisions by the county prosecutor. Well, teaching tool, huh? <laughs> I guess so. You could, you could put it that way, certainly. But best to be avoided, I think. It certainly yeah. was a teaching moment. Yes, yeah. yes, it, yeah. it yeah. certainly was. Mm. Thank you, Will. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.